dog sniff. You did tell him. Give it a dog sniff. <laughs> Tastes the same. <laughs> Trying to not be biased. I'm trying not to blow. Mm. <clears throat> Is Mexican coffee stronger than traditional? No, it's just no, cheap. It's called, cheap. It's <laughs> cheap. It's organic though. That could be that the lack of chemicals could be screwing it up. Yeah, that's, that's true. That could be it. Could be it. And does anybody actually trust organic stuff from Mexico? Seriously. It's a label. Are you kidding me? That's DDT coffee. No, I don't <laughs> trust organic. Why is it more expensive? That's what I don't get. Marketing shtick. They don't have to pay for chemicals. Good point. Exactly. Cheaper. Eggs. No chemicals. Yeah, mm -hmm. and it's more expensive. <clears throat> more labor, though. All that weeding. You can't spray. You have to go and hand pick all the bugs off uh, yeah, instead of spraying them with DDT, like they do in Mexico, <laughs> i.e., DDT coffee. That's the problem. So, um, the second, a little bit better than the first. First one kind of had a rusty flavor rust i did i did you pick, notice they pick up I the picked, rust yeah it, it wasn't like the back of a, a south <laughs> la school bus no, no. but it was kind of like the bumper off of a car that's mm. been stranded on the beach here yeah. in fernandina with a salty tint to it yeah a salty rusty tint it's got a little bit of aftertaste to it that's mm. a little bit funky yeah it tastes like chicory a little bit a little bit like chicory when it has any chicory in it huh no. Does it? No. 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 no? Hmm. <laughs> Maybe they should put some in it. <laughs> I don't know what chicory is, but is it one of those sticks that they used to go out and cut and whittle, whittle it into something they could whip kids with? No, that's a Chico stick you used to buy at the convenience store. No, that's store. what you used to eat when you go brim fishing. <laughs> <laughs> Chico sticks and Chico, RC cola, Chico man. Stick. Are you kidding me? Maybe some new grape. What did you guys do up in Connecticut? Or do you not fish? No. They skateboarded mostly. Skateboard? Skateboard. <laughs> Smoke pot? Shh. It's a family <laughs> show. Sorry. <laughs> Truth hurts. <clears throat> yeah, we had fish. We fished. Fish? Yeah. With dynamite? <laughs> like we do here? I've done firecrackers in the mm -hmm. water before. That's M80s and toilets. Yeah, M80s. Yeah, yeah mm -hmm. at the dorm. Mm -hmm. I know all about that. Mm -hmm. All right, guys. Any kind of scores? New guy? What I'm going to call... Um, Pre-biased new guy score so, on this pier. He's so biased, how can you even rate it? <clears throat> I I'm stuck at a C. A C. C. Okay. Okay. It's not my <clears throat> taste. I, I see you. Mm-hmm. I'll see your C, and mm -hmm. I'll raise you a plus. A C plus. C plus. <laughs> Actually, I, yeah, I'm on the cusp of a C plus, B minus. I don't have a lot of experience with stouts, except for the Hennessy. Not the Hennessy. <laughs> The Guinness, stout? the Guinness that I was drinking that I, it made me throw up in Switzerland <laughs> when I was smoking at Monte Cristo. That was the Monte Cristo talk. Right. Mm. So, you know, stouts bring back some pretty, you know. Stouts bring back good memories for me. But this one, I like it, but that rusty aftertaste. Yeah. Could, no. be, could be a bottling problem. Well, there was some rust on There's the inside rust. of the cap. <laughs> yeah, they, maybe if it was a stainless steel Examine cap. Examine the bottle cap. Um, all right, question. Excuse me. Rust, you know that that they, was a rusty burp. The aftertaste goes away after a few. Yeah. I mean, I, I bet if you drank two or ten of these, it'd go away. Yeah. Mm. All right, you're in the grocery store. You're away. picking out a stout beer. You've got a choice between this, <sighs> Guinness. Mm-hmm. Victory Storm King, what are you picking up? Uh, Storm King. Storm King. Storm yeah. King, although I'm a Guinness fan. Yeah? But I've had Guinness a million times, so I'm right. Storm King. All right. I haven't tried Storm King, so. Have you tried Guinness? Yes. Oh, I forgot to mention. I like Guinness. Let's hope to the so, extent... we'll kick you off this panel. <laughs> to the extent that it matters, and I didn't write it down, that's why I didn't mention it. This beer is 5.2% alcohol by volume, which well, your problem, not high is not another strike much. against it. If it's a stout, like the Storm King, 9.2. That's what I'm talking about. And this is 5.2? Obviously, something was amiss in the brewing of this beer, but not to dis distract from the great beer they do make at Dogfish, Dogfish Head, this is, not the one, this is not the one I'm going to buy. No. Not okay. the one I'm going to buy from them, although they got a lot of good ones. Yeah, and they, they pay do. us a lot of money to do this show, <laughs> so I don't want to piss them off. <laughs> don't blow it. I'm going to reevaluate yeah. based on endorsements like planners. Well, I've asked them to send us a, a year supply. 10K a show to have this, 
this can here. I've asked them to send us a year supply of the 90 minute IPA, and they have. But I didn't have the in the contract that we would give this a, a five a, five k a, a year to B-. Walmart for this green t shirt. <laughs> yeah, it's for Union Blues Walmart. brand. Yeah, no, it's not Walmart. South Bay. It's Kmart. <laughs> Kmart. All right, new guy. All right. I didn't score it. Oh wait, wait. We got one score to go. You can go ahead and get prepositioned. Yeah, you already said you don't like it. What'd you get? I said right now that I'm a non-committal. I yeah. was C plus B minus. I'm going to probably go. Is there? Is there? Something? He didn't even drink his. No. Is there something I can say that equals C plus plus B minus divided by two? That's what I'm going with. C plus. C plus plus, like the programming, <laughs> the programming language. That's why I'm going. I'm going with the programming language on this beer. I'm going to go uh, B minus. Think the beer's okay. A little bit funky aftertaste. Then that rust taste on the end of it gets it the minus. And there are better stouts out there. So Dogfish Head, just trying to be honest. Please don't pull. Pull the sponsorship. Don't, don't dollars. pull the sponsorship. <laughs> We're trying to keep this show on the air. We just built out this beer garden. Gorgeous out here today. So, hey, somebody be sure to water this ficus water. tree. <laughs> really, really starting to grow. It's starting to turn brown. And that's it. That's our show for tonight. Okay. Um, anyway, everyone drink responsibly. And but and a lot. don't necessarily drink that one. <laughs> <laughs>